2 News begins right now with a breaking news alert. And that breaking news is coming to us from Sugar Land. Sky 2 was over the end of a police chase involving a wrecker just moments ago. It started in Houston and ended here at Highway 90 and Brooks in Sugar Land. One person was taken into custody. Channel 2's Taisha Walker just pulled up to the end of that chase in Sugar Land along Highway 90. Taisha, we know you just got there, but what can you tell us about what you see happening there? Well, as you mentioned, Sarah, we've been here probably about five minutes or less. You can see uh, we're processing this scene along with you. You can see all of the Houston police vehicles out there at the intersection. And Adrian, if you can pan over to the left, you can see what appears to be that tow truck that led police on a chase for nearly 30 minutes. We do know that the chase started in Houston, as you said, at Bel Air in Highway 6 at around 2.55. Police tell us that the driver of the tow truck got into some sort of a crash after failing to stop and render aid. There was a chase about five minutes later. That driver leading police from Houston here to Sugar Land crashing into what appears to be this light pole here at Brooks and uh, Highway 90 where that chase ended about 30 minutes later. We uh, watched in the vehicle um, in our news truck coming here. That driver oftentimes going on the wrong side of the road to avoid police. But you can see this is where that chase ended. And you're also looking um, um, at traffic still moving here along uh, Highway 90. We did have to take the back road to avoid some onlookers coming from the opposite direction. But again, we do know that one person was taken into custody, likely the driver of that tow truck. And right now, police are working to assess the situation here. Reporting live in Sugarland, Taisha Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.